Okay, here's my worksheet with the data that I'd like to put into a clustered stacked column chart. So everything is just in a nice tight little table. I've installed the cluster stack chart utility and I can see a new tab on my ribbon for PTS charts. So when I click that, I'll see the button for the add-in. So I'll click a cell in my table and then I'll click the add-in button and a single dialog box comes up. We're going to have to just make a few entries in here to create our chart. So it's picked up the data range automatically and it's showing how many rows of categories. So we have our four and we have eight columns. We have four columns for each of two years. Then it wonders how many columns we should put for each category. So we have two years of data, so we'd like to see each year in a separate column. So we'll have two years for other, two for beef, two for lamb, two for poultry. So we'll leave this at the default. The next setting is how many blocks in each of the stacks. So we've got four seasons, so we want four in each stack. And to finish, we'll just click OK. Here's our original data sheet, and it's still just as we left it. There's a new sheet now, and our original data has been spread out and spaces added and labels. So that's all the work we would have had to do manually. Let me scroll down a bit, and there's our beautiful new cluster stack chart four categories, two stacks for each category, and all we had to do was click a button, set a couple of options, and there it was.